So let's get this started. Recruiting. A lot of y'all are scared about recruiting, right? <laughs> Why are we scared? Why are we scared? Okay, how do I get this? <laughs> On my slide. There we go. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, that a king dot com. Who may not know it because I saw that there's a lot of new people in here. 18 years in sales. So the first thing I'm going to say, if you want to recruit people, find sales people. Even though I made good money, even though I had the corner office, even though I was traveling and staying at nice hotels. Because I work for Starwood, I work for Marriott, I work for Hilton, and I work for Hyatt. Traveling the world convincing Fortune 500 companies to stay at one of our hotels. So proud but guess of you. what? I was never satisfied. I always wanted to do more. I always wanted to be an impact and help more people. Because I saw people checking into my hotels dropping their credit card on suites, 5000 4000 And I was wondering, how can they afford it? Now, yes, some of them were wealthy, and I didn't care about, you know, what's going to happen to that credit card bill. But here, I get to make a difference. So 18 years in sales, but I was still dissatisfied. I remember taking the train so I live in Brooklyn, I work in the city. And sometimes if I had client appointments, I would see people during the day just stress casual going about their day. And I'm wondering, don't they have a job? Why? What are they doing during the day? So I knew that I wanted to have flexibility. I also believe in stacking my coins, multiple sources of income. So while I was doing my hotel job, I was teaching in the evening. Adjunct professor, NYU, NYU graduate alumni. Woo! Finance. How is that possible? You're teaching and you're going to one of the best schools and you never learn finance. This business allowed me to learn and teach others about finance. And because of everything that I've learned, I was able to write two books in the four years that I've been with WFG. Woo! Woo! So recruiting has changed my life. And because I know this firsthand, I want to give everybody the same opportunity to change their life. If you ain't stacking, you drop it. You gotta make money, y'all. Or else y'all going to be broke. <laughs> this is why you broke. <laughs> That's right, girl. Woo! Hello. So I started WG in 2017 just because Angel, who is my angel <laughs> and my firstborn boy, will be named Angel. angel. Angel saw me at the time I was teaching at King's Ward Community College, and he was one of the people on a panel just talking about how his college prepared him. He could have said, you know what, she looks, she looks like she's smart. You know, I'm, I'm scared, I'm not going to talk to her. But he talked to me, and he asked me, what do you do besides teaching? And I said, well, you know, I'm always on social media, talking about stacking your coins, and I was telling people to save their money at a bank that's giving them more than 1%, or 1%. And I thought it was doing good, because I'm encouraging you to save. But now with WFG, I know there's a better place to get up more than 1%. So, you gotta light yourself on fire. 
Sometimes you're going to talk to people, it has nothing to do about money. You just got to light yourself on fire and let them come watch you burn. Yeah. But you're going to get them. Right? <laughs> That's right, girl. Your energy. When I was in sales, when the phone rang, it's showtime. We told you some sales today. I'm signing up some companies. Same thing here. When it's time to do that presentation, it is showtime. So we got to pick yourself up. Get that energy. They should not know you're having a bad day or, or whatever's going on. It's showtime. Time to make some money. Time to change people's lives. But you got to know what to say. Right? You got to say the right words. What are the right words? There's a lot of them. You guys are going to hear the words throw this convention tonight change your life. It could mean anything to different people. Who doesn't want to change their lives? Even if your life is good, won't you want a better life? Hmm. It's about changing your life. And have a strong belief. Have a strong belief that you're doing the right thing. We're showing people an opportunity to have their unborn kids wealthy. Guys, you know, when I get older, I already know kids are going to come up to me and say, because you sat with my mom, because you stayed with my husband, Because you know what? They remember stories. They remember 
stories. <laughs> Your music coming out, girl. <laughs> Or else what's gonna happen? They gonna be broke. And that's my time, y'all. <laughs>